All right, it is down to the final four in the Oregon High School Lacrosse Association playoffs. And among the teams playing for a state championship, uh, your alma mater, the Jesuit yeah, Crusaders. The Jesuit Crusaders. They have one of the strongest lineups in the state, and that includes one young man who has quietly become one of the best players in the country. Hey, hey, it's a step down. Time and room. Step into it. Best record in the state? Check. First team Metro All-Conference? Check. Under Armour All-American team? Check. He also just won the Metro Player of the Year award as well. Um, he's going to win a lot of awards. The honors? Just keep coming for Jesuit senior lacrosse player Tucker Dordovic. I'm like a perfectionist, so like everything I do, I, I just want to know I'm doing it properly. And like um, one thing I've talked to coaches, like I'm really into, like I like criticism, so I want to know what I can work on. And then like I like just staying and doing it and doing it and doing it until I have it down to an R. On Friday, Tucker and the rest of the Jesuit Crusaders overcame a 7-4 halftime deficit to beat Lake Ridge 11-10 in the state quarterfinals. It's not the first bit of adversity Tucker has had to deal with in his life. So I have dyslexia, which is like I read things backwards. I, I don't really uh, like I, I don't really see it anymore, but like definitely when I was younger and it was just hard, I could, like the environment. Relief came when his parents discovered Edison High School. The too small for sports private school is tucked away in the corner of the Jesuit campus. Athletes who attend Edison can play for the Crusaders. All of Edison's students have some sort of learning challenge. Some of the teachers do as well. Tucker says having adults in his life who can relate helped him in the classroom and on the lacrosse field. I would be at practice and I'd be like, okay, I have no homework to do. I can play, have fun, go home and go to sleep. And before it was like, okay, I'll go and play. I've been, my mind would be focusing on like a test I have later or a homework assignment I haven't done. So it's definitely easier. Tucker's time at Edison has helped him fulfill a dream to play lacrosse at a big Division I school. His next destination, ACC Lacrosse Powerhouse Syracuse University this fall. It's going to be different. I'm playing, I'm actually playing in uh, this game called the Under Armour All-American game here in July. So a lot of those guys are going to places like Syracuse or Duke or schools like that. So that will definitely be fun to kind of get a feel of what it's going to be like going against some like top players in the country. The Orange offered Tucker a scholarship and he happily accepted. Yeah, I'm a big, big fan of his. Tuck and I kid around quite a bit because I'm a big Maryland fan. Uh, but you know what? Don't tell him this. I'm going to be rooting for Syracuse big time next year. Man, that's a great story. Yeah. So much luck for Tuck. So 